I was streaming last night, and uh, I got asked a question. How did I get the Calamity mod for Terraria to work? That is what we are going to discuss today in this video. Now, there are two options. I'm going to show you the hardest option first, and it's not that hard. And then I will show you the very, very simple option, secondly. So stay tuned to see that. Are you an avid fan of modded Terraria? And trying to play the Calamity mod, but you keep getting this error. A problem has encountered during world generation. Calamity, Calamity dungeon biome chest. System null reference exception object reference. Not set to instance object. Uh, instance of an object. Well, now that sucks. I can't create any new worlds. Now here's your options. First option, which is a relatively easy option as well. Go to your store page. Or actually, I take that back. Go to your Terraria workshop. While in your Steam workshop, click on Other Worlds, and then search Calamity. In here, you should find Calamity maps such as this one. The one that I personally use is the Age of Calamity. Unfortunately, you do have to uncheck the other worlds. And then if you scroll down until you see the Age of Calamity, and it does say don't subscribe, subscribe and get rid of the modded blocks. This is true. So what you need to do is click on their YouTube link. It will bring up a pop-up, and in this will be a link to Media Player. Now don't click anything. Copy this. And bring up a new tab. Go to the link. Now you are going to need to download all of these. And once you have downloaded those, open your file explorer. Pull open your downloads. And you should have these downloads in there. Next, you're going to want to open another file explorer. And you're going to want to follow this path. Go to your documents, my games, Raria. Then you're going to see these. You're going to go into worlds and here you are going to see a list of your current worlds now you're going to take your downloaded files copy those and select all of those we're going to copy and you're going to paste them in here now i've already done this then you can close out of your file explorer And when you go into your key mod loader and launch this, all right, now that you are in game, you're going to want to go to either single player or multiplayer. Click on whatever character you are playing and go to migrate individual worlds. From this, you can migrate a world. Now this one for me has already been migrated because I am streaming this world. But if you click copy, such as this one, this is a world started in a, in a single player regular Terraria. You can see that it has migrated it over and we can launch this. But there is an easier way. We are going to exit out of our Tmod loader again. And we are going to go into our team mod loader workshop. Now here we are going to search for fix calamity. That is all you need to type in. And the first thing that should pop up is this five star rated fix calamity bug about world creating. So what this does, and it is explained in a technical sense, is that there is a bug. Uh, with a tmodder update, a 
change the scope of the variables which define the range in dungeon of the dungeon while the world is generated. Now this is created by the last prisoner. So props to him, giving him a quick shout out there. So what you're going to want to do is subscribe to this. Is it subscribe? Okay. It is subscribed. Okay. So now you're gonna go back to your T mod loader and launch this. This is a very simple fix. So this mod, once you have created your world and you're not going to create any more worlds, you can uh, disable this mod. But uh, if you're planning on creating multiple worlds, I would leave it active. It shouldn't hurt anything. So once you're all fully loaded up, and this may take a minute depending on how many mods you have installed. Currently, I have uh, quite a few. Okay, and now that you are all world loaded up, you're going to go into your workshop, manage mods. You are going to enable this. It is going to tell you reload required. That does not mean that you have to close T Mod Loader. You're going to hit back. It is going to reload all the mods, just like when you first logged in. Okay, and once your mods have loaded, up again now we can go into single player select your character once again and we can create a new world you can select any settings you want and you can create a world i will let this finish and i will to prove that this does work now so it seems like it gets stopped at desertification for a moment and then it continues going on and we are creating the underworld and going pretty quickly now. Okay, and we are almost done here. There we go. Final finishing up with some rust and dust. All right. And can we go? Now we have the Zealous Tunnel of the Pad 5. So we will launch this. And as you can see, we now have. A functioning single player or multiplayer whichever one you do whichever one you prefer map that is working just fine don't mind me that my friends is how you fix calamity team odd loader world generation bug simple and easy and again big props to the last person thank you and have a great day